Good morning guys and welcome back to World of Tanks, it's Gager262 and I'm doing another Black Market video. Today we have the second of the black vehicles that were being sold, of course the T-34B was sold twice, now the IS-6B, hopefully there's no problem with purchasing this one on any of the servers, but we won't know until later today, so this might be the only time you see it. The surprising part about the IS-6B is this 8,000 gold price tag for me. Now, I was going over the stats because I've never played the IS-6. I wasn't really looking forward to this vehicle. It's not one that I wanted, so I had never really researched it. But it looks like it does have some decent armor and the gun's pretty alright. Let me go into that's here. The 390 Alpha is the same. Actually, it's a little bit less than the T34B. Uh, it has a better damage per minute at 2,000. Has a better rate of fire. Its hull is slightly thicker with 110. The 150 for the turret is crazy. And the reason that this is even better is because all of it is angled. Top speed of 35 with a weight ratio, or specific power ratio of 13.5. So it's not going to be any faster than the T-34, but it is heavily armored. And the gun, while it won't do more alpha damage, will be able to fire more and penetrate more reliably. So... It is a little bit better. And the only reason I wanted to look at that is because I don't know why they would sell the T-34 for credits and turn around and sell the IS-6B for gold. Now, the only other thing I wanted to do with this video here is talk about that actual price tag. Because if you look at the IS-6 in the store now, or in the game rather, it's worth about 11,000 gold. So they're selling this one for just 20% off the original price. And the reason I'm bringing that up is, just like the T-34, this vehicle will be a novelty. So if you don't have the IS-6 at all, and you really want one, and you don't care about whether or not it's black, maybe consider picking this one up, because it's exactly the same. It's just 20% off, essentially. And if you're a collector who really wants one, same thing, 20% off gold. Now, if you're like me and you're not really a huge fan of the vehicle, you're not really sure if you want it, I would recommend just waiting because the more you play the game and the more you do, especially around big events, World of Tanks will give you like 30% coupons. I get them every now and then, like every month I get a 30% coupon I don't have to use. If you really want an IS-6, you don't know what the other vehicles are going to be during this event, or when, I should say, because we do have that list. So you do know what vehicles are there. And you're on the fence, don't buy it, just wait. Save that gold for some other black market videos, and just buy the normal one with a coupon later. And if you can't get a coupon, you know, just the 11,000 gold. Um... This is really going to be, normally I would say get it, just like with the T-34, because they're going to be interesting and fun tanks to play. They're some of the most popular tier 8 heavies, or premium heavies, and the reason is because the alpha they have, the armor they have, uh, is, I don't want to say it's good at tier 10, but it's not terrible, whereas the low has a hard time doing anything at tier 10. The Canaver and Action X cannot penetrate tier 10 vehicles or other tier 10 heavies and mediums. So these two vehicles are really, really well rounded. They're easy to use, easy to play, and they make good credits. Or at least I think that IS-6 makes good credits. I know the T-34 does. It's absolutely incredible at making credits. So I would say get it. But for 8,000 gold, while that is a nice discount, I don't know if it's worth just getting 
FBI at six in a black camouflage. You guys will have to make that judgment for yourself, and please let me know. It doesn't look like it's selling too fast, so you should have some time, simply because 8,000 gold just seems kinda high when they sold the T-34 for only 8 million credits. So, I don't know. I'm gonna pass on this one because, well, the I-6 is interesting to me. Not 8,000 gold interesting. Like I said, I'll probably end up waiting until another sale for the premium shop. Or I'll wait for a coupon and just buy it at the same price then. I'm not saying that's like a surefire thing that you should do. You should wait for those things. If you really, really, really want the IS-6 and if you really want the black version of the IS-6, I'd go ahead and pick it up now because I don't know when they're going to release the IS-6B again. But for me, I can wait because I already have one of the black vehicles. But if you can't, or if you really do like the IS-6, or if you think that the 8,000 gold is well worth it, please let me know in the comment section below. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you want to get notified on my next Black Market video later today, or any of the reviews I'm going to be doing afterwards, which I'm starting to play all my tanks a lot now so I can get a better feel for them when I do the reviews, subscribe to the channel. Love the support. Love discussing all this stuff with you. I really do appreciate it. Thank you so much for watching. I mean that sincerely. Thank you, thank you, thank you. It means so much to me to have everybody watching and engaging with me. And as always, I will see you next time.